Okay, me and the wife got up at two o'clock, and uh, we just kept an eye on this. Called the neighbors, couldn't get them up. Well, I don't know half of the neighbors down here anyway, so uh, we was worried about the people down there in that little White House because she was a handicap, and uh, I don't know if they ever got to her or not. They got a, a big pumps way down here in the corner, in a hole. We got big tubes like that that's pumping it out. Well, I think it's pretty bad, really, for us down here. But uh, and usually, this area here, we get a rain. This area is just like a big fishbowl. All, almost all summer long, it's full of water, and we can't get the city to do nothing about it. Actually, when it started raining, probably about an hour after it started raining, it started coming up just little by little. We had probably approximately, I don't know, four and a half foot up underneath our house. And the time we woke up this morning, we probably got maybe just a little over a foot. Yeah, we pretty much look out for one another. I mean, if we all need a hand, we're, we're basically there. We pretty much pretty much pretty tight down through here so if we find anybody who's got a problem we help them out. It's just the rain. We just, you know, we don't need the rain because to get more rain that, that means water comes up. It's got to go somewhere and right now the ground's so wet it's just draining right to the rivers. And yeah, down on the rivers and the creeks and rivers and stuff like that you got to basically, you know, got to prepare for the worst because, you know, We've lived down here probably 15 years and it's only happened twice, but you just never know.